Day seven, Monday the 7th of August, 2023, and it's about 20 past seven in the evening. It's a Monday, had things to do. At the time of doing the 2023 swim, I was living with Maria on the abundant land of a 91-year-old Ibithenk farmer. We often helped with the work and were rewarded with gifts from the land, apricots, lemons, oranges, figs, and much, much more. And Maria and I also had a lovely big vegetable garden that we were tending to throughout the summer. You'll see more on this in an upcoming episode. But before swimming today, it was time to pick figs for making jam. Got a cool cap tan, and I'm just making my way back down to my spot where I finished last night. And I'll be doing a very short swim this evening because the sun is about an hour and a half away from setting. So I've got myself an hour and a half to do 2.8 kilometers over to Benny Rust. So should just make it in time before the sun sets and um, the drummers go crazy. Just found this little friend along the way. Hello there, how are you? And here we are. Wrapping up this little secret right here. Okay, here we go. 1933. And we're heading out there. Just 13 minutes in, but it is pretty damn beautiful here. Gotta love the north of Ibiza. You gotta just love Ibiza, really. This beautiful cave right here. Pretty epic, I tell you. I know, you're all wondering why I didn't get up and go for it. So we are just 40 minutes in. It's uh, 20 past 8. And here I am, just coming into the bay of Benirus. We've got the drummers over there, the boats, and the Benirus rock. The fist. This looks a little bit different from here and at the moment you've got a couple of helicopters flying by as well it looks like they might possibly be putting out a fire i did see some smoke earlier so let's hope that's all resolved nice and easy and then tomorrow if that's when the next day's swim is hopefully it will be tomorrow i'll be heading around there past san miguel past where we did that amazing film with the man Kristen, good man Kristen, dj then heading around to our there's Portage Hole, where I might pull in for the day. Maybe get to meet Maria there and have a nice little chill out on the beach. Or I'll head round to Albaraca. And yeah, head on into the beach now. That was nice and easy. It's 8.31, less than an hour swim. And pretty spectacular way to come into Benny Ross here with that sunset and this drumming going on right there. And I must have loved elements just over there. Well, you can't see it quite yet. And go and get a closer look at the swimming. At the drumming, I mean. <laughs> Let's take a swim and get a closer look at the drumming. 8.35. So that's just under an hour. This is from, from Beach. That's Benny Ross at the magical sunset. And the drumming happening right here on the beach. Beautiful. Um, no taxis in Benny Russ and um, I decided just to go to the old school way and do a little bit of hitchhiking. So, a lovely guy named Jamel took me from Benny Russ up to the petrol station and then third or fourth car that drove past me, a lovely guy named Thomas just brought me up here to the roundabouts. So I'm going to go from here to go back up to where my car was um, in the way of Portinax. Let's see if I can find a taxi or another friendly hitchhike helper. <laughs> And there goes Sergio, legend. Three pickups, nice and easy, quick and easy. Dropping me right here where I can walk onto where the car was. And there you have the wonderful magic of Ibiza. I finished my swim at 8.30. It's now 9.20 and I have hitchhiked three lifts from Benny Russ all the way here to the road to Port Max. Just exploring the different ways of doing this swim. Each day different, alive and unique. Got a little couple of kilometers I reckon to walk down this road then onto the dirt road 
and then I'll go and get myself some food, have a good rest, and see what's in store for us tomorrow. Got another hitch with some others heading down towards Kalashraka, which is quite cool of them. Happy days, and this will be the last report from this day's swim. Big love from Ibiza. Check. Oh.